Hey good people, my name is James Kirkland and I have the pleasure of bringing you today's devotions. So hello to you, whatever time of day it is, um, morning, afternoon, evening, I hope you're doing well. Um, the verse I'm going to be talking about today is a very simple verse, very quick one, it's Proverbs 16 verse 3, which is commit your works to the Lord and he will establish your plans. Uh, I don't know if you've ever been in the situation where you've got to do something which is significantly out of your comfort zone, maybe slightly above your skill level, maybe something that you kind of haven't done before, or you're sitting there and you're thinking, I can't see what the other side of this actually looks like. I don't quite know how I'm going to get there. Um, and, and it weighs heavy on you. Um, it's a burden on you. Um, Maybe you're one of these people that makes kind of a five and a ten year plan of all the things that kind of you want to achieve. And, and sometimes, you know, sometimes it can be a burden in life thinking, oh, have I, have I met my goals? Have I, have I done what I really, really need to do? That's not to say that we shouldn't have uh, objectives and we shouldn't have goals, but we shouldn't be in a situation where they weigh so heavy on us that they take the joy of life from us. And I think that's very much what God is talking about in this verse um, what the Bible's referring to. And I, I picked that up from the first word, which is the word commit. And I'm not a, I'm not a deep biblical scholar. I, I do cheat. I went and read Strong's Concordance, looking at, uh, at what the actual original language used here was. And I want to focus on two things about the first word commit. And it's actually from the Hebrew word, which means to, to roll. And I think that gives us a sense of two things. The first is, if we're, if we're going to roll something, it indicates that it's quite heavy. Um, you know, you, you, can, you can pass something that you can kind of pick up and carry. But if you're rolling something, I don't know, like a bowling ball or something like that, it, it's heavy. Um, so, you know, our plans can often be burdens. They can be heavy. They can weigh heavy on us. The second thing is when you roll, you, you release. You, you let it go and you entrust the person that you're rolling to with it. You're, you're, you're kind of handing it off. Um, and I think that's the other thing that God wants to talk about here is, is kind of release, release these things, unburden yourself and release your plans to release your works to me and I will establish your plans. It's great. I'm just going to pray now for your, for your day. Uh, whatever time of day it is, we're going to pray um, using this verse. We're going to say, Father God, we just want to thank you now for, that you're a God that likes to bear our burdens, that doesn't want us to be weighed down with the things of life, with, with all the things that buzz around our heads in terms of what we're going to do, what we're going to see, have we reached our goals, have we done what we need to do. Father God, today we just unburden ourselves. We take all of our works and we roll them to you. We release them, knowing that we can trust you to establish our plans. Amen. Right, guys, I hope you have a fantastic day, whatever time of the day it is, and uh, look forward to seeing you at church. God bless.